name is Race Con, and I'll be making a modified version of ch classic chocolate chip cookies. I'll be adding my favorite heart healthy ingredients, and I will decide if these ingredients make the chocolate chip cookies taste like chocolate chip cookies, or at least uh, look like them. Okay, before we do anything, we must put the oven on and set it to 350 degrees. <clears throat> so now, we will start with a stick of butter. Make sure the butter is at uh, room temperature so they can uh, mix in with uh, sugar and all the rest of the ingredients nicely. <clears throat> okay, so next, we must add the egg. The egg should also be room temperature so that it can also mix in. We're gonna add a quarter of a teaspoon of vanilla to the mixture. Vanilla gives it uh, a nice and vanilla taste. Okay, now once the vanilla is done, we get to the hard healthy ingredients. First we start with uh, some chopped almonds. After the uh, chopped almonds are done, we also put some semi-sweet uh, chocolate chip and also uh, oats and shredded coconut. The semi-sweet chocolate chips should be uh, <coughs> about uh, just a cup of that and also about a cup of shredded almond. The oats are very healthy, very hard healthy. Coconut can also give a nice coconut taste. <clears throat> we also have to put some cocoa in to give a chocolate taste, or else it won't taste as chocolate. We mix all this together for about a few minutes. And we also have to add the peanut butter while this is mixing. Peanut butter is also an added ingredient. It was in the recipe. You add the peanut butter to make it uh, more healthy. Next, we add half a teaspoon of baking soda. We also add three quarter of a cup of flour. You should mix it until it's well blended up right now. <clears throat> Once the mixture is complete, you're ready to put in the oven. But first, you can make it two balls. I've cleaned up, and now I'm going to use an ice cream scoop to make the chocolate chip cookies. Now, make sure that the cookies are well separated and are not as big so that they don't become one giant cookie in the oven. Okay, I baked them for 15 minutes and it's been 10 minutes since I took them out. And it looks like a chocolate chip cookie and I hope it tastes like one. You can taste the crunchiness and the uh, texture is just absolutely nice and smooth. It's it's really good.